Hey guys welcome back to another video hope you guys are doing great and today we will be reviewing the airpods pro I bought the airpods pro from the flipkart big billion day sale for 18,000 indian rupees and I am more than happy with the purchase because I paid 7,000 rupees less than the actual price so without wasting any more time let's get into the unboxing experience I am not gonna lie as soon as the package arrived I just opened it up because I was too excited to see what was inside but I'll try to keep the experience as close to the original as possible. So at first you get the standard documentation and no Apple stickers. And then there's the actual product, the AirPods Pro. And below that you get some extra silicone tips and, and a lightning cable for charging. And that's it. Now let's talk about the design. I don't know why but I expected them to be bigger than what they actually are. But their small size makes it actually easier for them to be carried around. I previously had the Realme Buds Air Neo and the LG Tone Free FN6. And in my opinion the AirPods Pro has the perfect shape and size. It fits perfectly inside the smaller pocket inside the pocket of my jeans. The force sensor may seem frustrating at the beginning. But after you get used to it, the one thing that you will be missing is accidental touch. I have had a lot of problems with accidental touch during my online classes but now that problem seems to have completely gone. Applying pressure on the force sensor you can hear a small subtle sound and you can be sure that you have applied pressure on the right area. The case is quite tough and heavy and I know Are they heavy? Yeah. Then they're expensive. Put in if you are concerned about the protection of your AirPods Pro, then you should probably check out the AirPods Pro cases by ESR Gear. They are available in a lot of colors and they absolutely complement your AirPods Pro. The silicone tips helps create a nice seal without giving you that uneasy feeling because of the pass through cutouts. There is an extra layer of mesh on the silicone tips to ensure that the gunk from your ear does not enter the actual device. Sound quality. I found myself to be completely blown away by the sound quality. Because the previous earbuds that I owned, the Realme Buds Air Neo was an entry level earbud with average sound quality and no noise cancellation and the LG Tone Free was a bit expensive but the one part where it sucked was the sound quality. So for me, the AirPods Pro felt like a breath of fresh air and I know that a lot of better options are available if your primary focus is sound quality but the thing is that you don't get as many features as the AirPods Pro offer. The AirPods Pro is loaded with a bunch of awesome features. Noise cancellation. Probably the best feature of the AirPods Pro. It activates as soon as you put the earbuds in your ear, even before connecting it to your iPhone or iPad. Noise cancellation on the AirPods Pro is really amazing. Even if you are sitting in a crowded coffee shop or traveling by car or you are in a flight or traveling by train, you get to hear all the noise but in a much reduced way. You can actually put your focus on the lyrics of the song while noise cancellation is on. If noise cancellation is not enough, you get another cool feature, Spatial Audio. Spatial Audio helps you get the best cinematic experience. A premium audio experience where sound moves around you, above you and behind you, as Apple describes it. There are three available modes that you can choose from. The first one being noise cancellation that reduces the overall noise that you hear. Then there is transparency mode which is just the opposite of noise cancellation. This mode is helpful when you want to be disturbed by outside noises like when you are in a railway station and you want to hear the announcements. And last there is just an on mode, it does nothing fancy except to save some battery. The battery life was considerably good for me. I carried them with me on a 7 hour long train trip and it did survive for that long. Yes it did, I am not bluffing. Obviously I didn't use them continuously for 7 hours but probably for about 4 to 5 hours and they still had some juice left after that long journey. They also support wireless charging and a 5 minute charge can give you a boost for about an hour. The AirPods Pro charges via lightning port still in 2021. Another cool feature worth mentioning is the optimized battery charging. Your AirPods learn from the daily charging routine so that the AirPods can wait to finish charging past 80% until you need them. A simple feature which is added to reduce battery aging 
because the battery on the AirPods Pro is irreplaceable. The one thing that really annoys me is the connectivity issue. Now I don't know if it happens only to me because I use it with my Android smartphone or it is actually an issue but sometimes the volume would get stuck at a certain level and sometimes the sound won't even play. There is no volume control feature as well so you would always have to ask Siri to do that for you but since I use it with my Android smartphone I always use the volume buttons on the smartphone itself. The experience of using the AirPods Pro with my Android smartphone is not bad at all. You get all the important features like active noise cancellation although you don't get spatial audio. The force sensor seem to work. The AirPods Pro are IPX4 water resistant and they are good for workout. Can the AirPods Pro be recommended in 2021? Yes, they can be recommended easily. There are a lot of earbuds in the market that are good with specific features like some are better at noise cancellation, some have a better sound quality, some have a better design, better battery life and some are good for workout. But there is only one product that does it all at once and it's the AirPods Pro. You can also check out the AirPods 3 that came out recently. Clearly not a better option than the AirPods Pro but if you want to save a bit more and you are willing to give up active noise cancellation then you should definitely check out the AirPods 3. Thank you for sticking till the end of this video, hope you guys enjoyed it. Press that subscribe button and hit the bell icon so that you never miss any new video. Have a nice day everyone.